mean, it's time to learn today. I would like to teach you all how to disassemble the PC. Mm, first of all, we unplug the keyboard and the mouse USB plug. And this U this one is the USB port. And this scene, this one is the 2.0. And this three round button is this one is the first one is for the speaker. The second one is for the microphone and. The third button is for the uh, other devices and this one is for the printer and this one also the USB port and this one the round one is is uh, for the PS2 one and also our previously our um, mouse this one is round one so we can uh, for our keyboard and mouse we can plug into the round button so firstly we need to unplug the this one power and this one is for the LCD one to our screen, LCD screen. And we tie up the, all the screw here. And we lay down there. And we open the cover. I would like to introduce the component inside the CPU. This one is the power box. This one is the heat sink. This one is the lower fan. This one is the RAM. This one is the graphic card and this one is the data communication cable and this one is the disk drive and this one is have a SEMA battery and also the hard disk and this one is the main power cord cable that support electric from the power box Firstly, I want to remove the heat seal so I switch the button into the left for all the buttons and pull the button up and remove the heat seal and inside the this one is the processor so I want to remove the processor I need to press the button here and unlock and this one is the processor So when we remove the processor, we have to uh, carefully remove because this one is con contain a poor glow. And this is the processor. So now I, we, I, we need to assemble back. And the code here, we have to face into this round button. And close back the cover. Pull down and lock back. Now I want to plug back the heat sink, so I have to put down the heat sink and lock back. So I turn the button into the right hand side, or the button into the right hand side. So it's locked, it's tight, make sure the casing is tight. Next I want to uh, remove the RAM. So first I will have to unlock the RAM, then take it up. This one is the Kingston 4GB RAM. And I assemble back. This one also is the RAM. Also Kingston 4 gig RAM. So two pieces is the 8 gig. So I assemble that. So I lock back the RAM. So make sure this one is very tight. If not, the PC cannot run already. Okay. Next, I want to remove the SEMA battery. Firstly, I have to pull the pin here to remove the SEMA battery and take the SEMA battery out. This, if the SEMA battery is expired, so the PC, uh, the PC times and the date will re reformat. So we have to change the new battery. That this battery is worth only 
to um, you can buy from the stock only two ringgit fifty cent. So now we brought back the cinema battery. This one is the gap, is the support the electric for the lower fan. So first I want to remove the gap. Then we have to open the screw behind here. This one is the power cord sub, uh, which is support the electric for the motherboard and the power come from the power box. So now I want to remove the main power cord. So I have to press the pin here and remove. So if the if the cable is not support to the motherboard, the whole PC cannot function. So now assemble back. Make sure it's tight. Plug back tightly. Okay. First, I need to op open up the screw here. And press the pin here. Press the go in and remove the. This one is the data communication cable that link to the diskette drive and now we are no longer use the diskette drive I want to remove the hard disk first I want to uh, take out the data communication cable so I need to press the pin here and remove the, the cable then this one is the power cable this one is the support the electric from the power cord to the hard disk so I remove the power cable and open the screw here to remove the hard disk this have two screw here so we have to open the screw then the hard disk can be removed I want to plug back the data communication cable to the hard disk so it's pin back and this one is the power cable so lock back okay. so now it's complete uh, assemble, assemble back the whole PC so we need to use the cover to close back the CPU To screw back uh, all the screw. This one is have four button, so we have to screw back. <laughs> and we need to plug back the cable. This one is the seat, uh, keyboard and the mouse, so we have to plug back. And this one is the for the uh, the screen monitor. So we have to lock that. And this one is the power power cable. Okay, complete. So we now open back the PC. Next, I want to remove the hard disk. 